welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing a kitting up. I'm going to be kitting up my paint gem set that I got during the Black Friday sale. I got it for $27.92, I think. Normal price is about $35. Um, so this is the mystery edition. Mainly I got this one because I liked that it had a couple of their, a couple category of their normal categories so i saw there was a museum national park space around the world and her story so i thought this would give me an opportunity to to sample all of them i don't think i don't know if if it's going to be a repeat of one of their current ones or these are going to be completely different i'm hoping they're going to be completely different um so this thing actually has a good amount of drills um, I, I have another set from them that was a partial and it was actually not that many drills. And I do also like that this thing has a good chunk of color. So each of these lines are tw um, 12, so 12, so let's say it's 48 minus two, so it's 46 colors here. So 46 colors and it actually is a full drill um, canvas with poured glue. These are squares, there are DMCs and today I'm kidding this up on December 29, 2022. Um, I, I recorded like three kit ups today. So I don't know when this is going to be posted. So well, we'll see. We'll see. But this one will be a little bit easier for me to measure the sizes, I think. And they actually do have like a one, two, three on the bottom. So these first six are the same size. So the first six is a six by nine. So because on the site, it just says it's 10 by 15 by 12. So it's actually six by nine times six. And then the next size is this. These ones are the space ones. The space ones are all the same size, I think. Yeah, they're all the same size. I just put it to the light. So the space ones are seven and a half centimeters by seven and a half centimeters. So 7.5 by 7.5 times three. And then I do, I can kind of tell what some of them are, but it's not obvious. And then the around the world, there's two of them and those are the same size. So I'm just putting it to the light. And this is an eight by 12. So eight by 12. And then there's two of these by two. And then the last one is the her story. So it does look like it'll be a female in here. This one is actually pretty, pretty substantially sized compared to the other. So this is a 10 by 15. So 10 by 15 times one, there's only one of these. So I do have a better grasp of the size of these. I don't know if I'm, should I just do them in order? Am I that kind of boring? Do one in every category and then go back. I might do that. Do one in every category and then go back. So there actually is a good amount of colors in this. So I decided to use this storage here. Um, this has 60 bottles and I think this is from Art Dot. And I figured I can put the diamond paintings into here. And can I fit this in here? All right, I can fit that so I can toss this. I don't need this. Although it's a pretty nice box. I might want to just keep it to put stuff in it. But do I want to be one of those people that just keeps boxes? <laughs> but yeah, I figure I could put the diamond paintings in there. Ooh. I have one of these is will it fit in here so that 
it doesn't just all kind of fall out. This came with one of my storage. I don't know which one. I have so much storage. So I was gonna just put them in there. And then I'm, I did actually scan this so that I have my own copy of this. Okay, so they're not in DMC order. I, am, I will put them in alphabetical order at the end of the video. Um, but for now, I'm just going to label everything. For whatever reason, it's easier for me to label when bottles are in that direction. Actually, I don't know if it's that much easier. <laughs> So I do like that this actually has a decent amount of colors, but um, I did notice when I was kitting up my um, my other paint gem one, which is the houseplant edition, that the colors were kind of grouped together by color. And I'm pondering if these were kind of just charted separately and then kind of combined. And that's why the colors, they're not in DMC order. Oh, wait, this is an alphabetical A, B, C, D, oh, E and F are separate, G, H, I, J, K, L, M. The only thing is Z is first for whatever reason. So this I might not have to do much alphabetical order in this. Maybe I just maybe I'll just replace this with an empty one. Um so I don't, I don't have to move anything around. But yeah, and no, I was like looking, I was like, hey, look, they're in actually in alphabetical order. This is, I think, one of their newer sets. So maybe this is them putting things in alphabetical order. Is Z the first letter in some alphabets? I don't know. I might, like I said, I'll have to switch those, but I'll keep them in this order for the kidding up portion. But yeah, it does seem like they are actually in alphabetical order, except for Z, which is earlier. So I might leave a space after the Y so that I could put Z in there. I'll leave a space. Maybe I'll just put one, two, three to nine in this next section here so I have more bottles but yeah no the they are in actually in order And then I'll just put the symbols in the next row. So that's like the symbol for how much bars do I have left? Here's the symbol for, I don't know, that's the volume. There's a lightning bolt, a star, just one arrow, but that's okay. That I'm okay with arrows if there's just one. There's a umbrella looks like the male bathroom symbol <laughs> a moon here a triangle I don't normally like triangles but there's only one triangle so that's okay a coffee cup and that's an interesting one I don't think I see that one that often and then three dots so there's that I wonder will this stick do you think this here will stick to the bottom? Okay. 
it's kind of questionable sometimes whether these labels will stick to this material here, but I'm hoping it will. We'll see, we'll see. Okay. Tray here. Forty six nine nine five here. Okay, there is some static. I did put it next to my humidifier. So hopefully that will settle the static a little bit there. My humidifier is off camera. It's like over, over there. <laughs> but it's it's within distance of me. Nine nine six. There's a good amount of static in this one. Okay. I, did I put enough moisture on this thing? There. So I do like that there's actually a good amount of colors in this, but I'm not sure if all the colors will be in all the diamond paintings. So there could just be a good amount of colors because there's a good amount of types of diamond paintings in this. Not necessarily that the colors will be of sh because of nice shading effect. This is a really pretty color here. Yeah, I see static. Okay, put it next to my humidifier there. You know, the last one I did wasn't that static -y. static. Yep, and pretty much every single one of them has static. You can also get like a dryer sheet and mitigate the static, but I don't know. I know someone told me that they pour their drills onto a dryer sheet and then pour them into the... But it doesn't get rid of the static that's inside. I'm, gonna... I'm just going to put a drop of water into it. Okay. This is like um, water with um, isopropyl alcohol. 
I figure it's better than using dryer sheets. Perhaps I should just use the alcohol. It works a little bit better when there's more drills because then the liquid is a little bit more dispersed and the bag doesn't get too wet, but... It'll dry by the time I diamond paint it. And if it doesn't, it'll dry on top of my canvas. Actually the first time I'm using this storage. I got this on Amazon when it was like, I don't know, there was a sale of some sort and I think it was, it ended up being like less than $15. I think it might have been like $12. Okay, for 310, look at how little 310 there is on this one. I think there's a couple of the bags that look pretty decently full. I don't know if I'll need any extra bottles. I do like that the baggies are in order. Especially since the DMCs are not in order. So. It would be a little bit more difficult if the bags were just kind of thrown in there. couple that were pretty staticky so far these ones in the middle haven't been too bad okay this bottle doesn't want to open right there See, they're not in order. See, it says 430, 433, 434, 435, 
Okay, there's like a random drill on my tray, which was not that color, so... Random drill in the bag. Four, four, four here. Okay, this one's not turning this lovely yellow. Nine. I don't know if it'll all fit. Okay. I do have extra bottles. So. I don't have that much more left, so I'm okay with using another bottle. And there's two more labels in this thing. Nine three nine and eight twenty three actually look very similar. Um, eight twenty three is just not as dark. I'm guessing this is going to be for the space one because there's two space ones. Three three six. Okay. one there go in three one seven so these are all the grays it looks like One eight four one five Okay, I can see static on this one. So I'll just breathe into it. Settle down the static a little bit. There you go. And I didn't really notice 762 as a color until like it was like one of the predominant colors on something that and they used it pretty much like white and I was like oh that's it's like an off-white. Yes. So 762, like if you if you have like ABs that are like only like 
like 3865 or 5200, you can probably use those ABs for 762. You don't need, you don't need ABs that are 762. Although I think I do have square ABs 762. <laughs> and I'll probably, I wouldn't, yeah, I'll probably like pawn, like for this mystery set, I won't be able to replace anything with ABs because I don't, I don't know what they're going to be. But for my other one, I probably will just do it on a diamond painting by diamond painting basis. So I won't like completely replace them. I'll just be like, oh, what can I replace on this one? Kind of thing. 704. Unless I'm, I'm not doing at home, I probably will just do them all at home. But these make good travel with you diamond paintings because they're small and even the diamond painting will fit in your container. seem like there's too much of the reds and stuff so I wonder wonder what they would be part of okay. I could see some of static in this one might just add just do the little bit of water Six. Nine forty seven here. Seven. Forty then looks like a bunch of blues. Okay, there's some static. here. This one has static too. <sighs> Not enough. Other than 939, seems like everything else just fit in one bottle. Okay. Come on, I only have two more in there. Look at that, a lot of static in that one. 
And then last color here, the Z, which I was going to switch the bottles. Okay, I think my breathing was not enough. A little bit more. Okay, I think that might be enough. There. Okay, so I was said I was gonna move this. So now they're actually in alphabetical order, numerical order, and then the symbols back here. And then 939, which I was thinking, let's just move this here and put it right next to 939. All right, so there is this one kitted up. So this, and then I'll probably just kind of do these periodically. I don't know if I'm gonna sit down and do all 12 at the same time. Will I sit down and do all 12 at the same time? Maybe for my houseplant one, I might sit down and do like three at a time or something and do it over four days. Or maybe four, four at a time and do them over three days. Or do six at a time and do them every 12 and do them at two days. We'll see. Um, but this one, this one might be one of those ones that's fun to do one at a time since they are different themes and they are actually full drill ones. So there might actually be some confetti in these. Are these going to be full of confetti? I don't know. I might do, I might do... A couple of them in a whip and chat. So those might be one of those. Don't watch the whip and chat if you don't want to be spoiled kind of things. But yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Will I do those in order? Yeah, how long will that take? Hmm. They're, the symbols are really small. I'm not sure if I like these these symbols here but yeah we'll see all right so that's all i have for today so um be on the lookout probably for me doing the one or two or three i don't know of these in a whip and chat um and yeah that's all i have for today so thank you very much for watching and happy diamond painting bye